Philippine news today. Please subscribe and then check notification box to get all breaking news alert. President Donald Trump has taken a big trip around Asia to continue with the negotiations in the region and to tie up loose and take a shared victory lap. What the media can't resist is make a panic that the president's trip will trigger a nuclear war, a classic situation in which he proves them wrong with every other meeting. This is a typical media hysteria with no relative background. President Donald Trump has already won the negotiations in the region and this trip is a success, telling even from now. The president is not going to brag and gloat about this because of his modesty but we still need to know that he already managed to accomplish more than Obama, Bush and Clinton combined. While the previous presidents were only talking, President Donald Trump has made a difference. China has joined the US and is hitting North Korea where it hurts. The Chinese are on the edge and have to stay on the U.S. side because they don't know what President Trump might do with the trade deals. This gives Trump big advantage in these talks so in other words he is in the driver's seat and China goes where he takes her. The results speak for themselves. We finally have a leader whose actions are bringing results and contributing to a better and stronger America. As part of this trip he also together with the First Lady took a visit to Pearl Harbor. Before the visit for Fox News he said. We are going to visit very shortly, Pearl Harbor, which I've read about, spoken about, heard about, studied, but I haven't seen. And that is going to be very exciting for me. When he got there Trump did something that none of the previous presidents did. Instead of bragging and talking he gave respect to the fallen soldiers with silence. And that is how a real respect is given, is given, 